I think just his attitude and his, his, his dedication to, to Gaelic Games first and foremost and obviously to his club, Parnell's GA club and, and then by extension to Dublin GA. Um, you know, I think his, his, uh, his relentless pursuit of, of, of excellence is, is, is something to behold. Um, he's an exceptional leader for the team as well and sets a great example for everybody. Look, I think all the super ladders have been used around Stephen uh, for, for, for many a year now. Um, Look, it's big. I only saw the, the list of, of players who've kind of got up to that sort of mark and it's crazy and he's, he's kind of beat them all. So, look, it's a uh, so kind of measure of the man in fairness to him. He's, he's uh, so dedicated to his craft uh, and no man deserves it more than now, Stephen. Now. He's a big presence for the, for the team on the pitch and off the field uh, and long may it continue. Well, first of all, obviously, it's a phenomenal achievement um, and couldn't happen to a nicer fella. The, the most impressive thing about Cloco is that no airs and graces about him whatsoever. He's, as you kind of touched on, he's a great influence around the dressing room, but not in any kind of overstated way. He just goes about his business and kind of sets sets the example, sets the standards himself, and then we all strive to live up to that. And then, I suppose, more importantly than all of that, he's a great fella and a great friend to all of us who are involved. So it was an honour to be out on the pitch on the day that he, he got that kind of milestone.